Jason, this time, well, from a philanthropic perspective, and philanthropist Manu Chandaria has called on the youth, well, to exercise while well, restraint during these tough political times and indeed push for peace by not getting drawn into, well, violence and demonstrations and other political violence during these heated political times. His call to the youth comes just, uh, well, about 40 days to the election. Take a look. All elections, whether this cup coming up one after that, uh, what we saw in 2007, we were very, very sure that it can repeat. And so in 2012, 13, we made very sure the youth were all talked to. We had 2,000 people, youth from here, from all the counties in Nairobi for two days to talk to them and say, go back and talk to your people. This cannot go on. And thank God that we didn't have one case. So I hope that this is the same issue again. Let's be peaceful in our election. Let us make sure that we are non-violent in whatever we do, in thought, word, and deed. Why I'm saying this because uh, a lot of people will start talking that you know we could be violent, we could be this way. And in counties, in fact, I would say in counties or at polling stations, somebody will win, somebody will lose. They'll be announced, results will be announced. Fake news we must be careful about, but at the same time, it is important not to lose your temper, not to get angry or not to get emotional about it and start picking up fights.